there, but hey. Um, now, whether it's Come By Art, remember that? Lord of the Dance. Do All things remember? bright and beautiful. Oh, all right. Many of us remember our favourite songs from school. Sit quietly now on the uh, on the floor because one teacher <laughs> who's really embraced this assembly nostalgia is James B. Partridge. He's become a social media hit after posting his versions of the classics online. We're going to speak to him. He has a keyboard with him in a moment. But first, let's listen to some of his favourites. Who put the colours in the rainbow? Who put the salt into the sea? When I needed a neighbour, were you there? Were you there? He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole wide world in his hands. One more step along the world I go. One more step along the world I go. There's water, water of life. Jesus gives us the water of life. So I mustn't forget. No, I mustn't forget. Dance and can't leave it there. That was my favourite. It's a favorite. classic, isn't it? James B. Partridge is here, luckily, with his keyboard. Good morning. Thank morning. you for coming in. Thank you very well, much. Well, this has taken off, hasn't it? It has, yeah. I didn't think this would this would be happening, but here we go. <laughs> Got the keyboard straight from school. What? I, uh, OK, what on earth? How did it start? I think what on earth is a good question. What on earth? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, essentially, I did a lot of uh, online lessons during lockdown. And um, so a good way to kind of engage my pupils was putting some singing tips and music tips on YouTube. And then someone said, oh, have you heard about TikTok? And I thought, oh, uh, I thought it was just for dancing. So I put up a few things on there. And then um, I had been with some of my friends talking about uh, what song to have at his wedding. And we kind of were reminiscing about all the songs we sang at school. And then I thought, you know what, I'll put up a top 10 of, you know, now that's what I call school assembly bangers, you know, that kind of thing. And I'm mean, very niche. But uh, I, I posted this thing kind of thinking that a few of my friends would, would watch it. And it, yeah, kind of took off and people were sharing it and writing their own memories about all the songs they sang at school. And, you know, getting comments like nostalgia unlocked and <laughs> everyone very kind of uh, talking about all the songs that should have been in the top 10 that I missed out, so. Because when you hear those songs, we were saying this morning, you're back in assembly, aren't you? Yes. Yeah. You're there with your shorts on and you've got your legs crossed yeah. and you... I feel like we should be on the floor with our legs crossed. <laughs> we nearly were. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we nearly were. Yeah, yeah. Had the smell of yesterday's lunch. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And what, I mean, people, you've had a million follows and, and views on, on social media. What, what are people's favourites? What, what, what are they requesting? Um, so, uh, a lot of people loved... Um, can I play with it? Yes, 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 please. So, um, this is a proper, uh, legit... School, for school keyboard, so it's not the best quality, but there we go. Should we sit um, on the floor? Yeah, no, we can sit on the floor. Uh, so you just imagine you've got the school apparatus up on the walls, and yes. uh, uh, so here we go. This is um, He's got the whole world in his hands, he's got the whole wide world in his hands. So that was that was a very popular one. Is that number one? No, it wasn't. All oh, right, okay, well, no, don't tell us yeah, what number okay, one is yet. Let's okay. wait. Let's wait, okay. So, what, what, what other ones? Let's do like uh, top so we three. Had, um, so, this is very fitting because we're coming up towards the end of term. And uh, this is a great one for the Leavers Assembly, and it goes... One more step along the world I go One more step along the world I go And a lot of people actually sang from this book. I don't know if you recognise well, this. It's Come and Praise. Yeah. Yes. No? Yeah. Yes. yes. It's weird, isn't it, when you see something that's so familiar years later. Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. remember this. That's one of the original copies as Come well. Come and yeah. Praise, BBC Radio for Schools. This has got all the words Yeah, in. yeah. Oh. Go on, give us another okay, one. Okay, so um, one of the ones that I loved was called Who Put the Colours in the Rainbow? Oh. It goes, um, Who put the colours in the rainbow? Who Isn't put that the not the same the tune as the last one? <laughs> yeah, it's very similar. <laughs> you know, that, that's why these songs are so catchy. Um, and uh, one that everyone loves is uh, Lord of the Dance. Yes, come on, John's kind of favourite. It's kind of been uh, used as a football chant quite a lot. Yes. So you probably hear it at Old Trafford or something. Yeah, let's not so, do those uh, words. I, I won't do those <laughs> words at this time in the morning. So, <laughs> dance then wherever you may be i am the lord of the dance 30 and i'll lead you all wherever you may be and i'll lead you all in the dance 30. that's a classic there we go was that number one uh, no it wasn't actually <laughs> should, should we should we try but what, go on you're going to show okay us so uh, i these were my top two and they were very controversial because i feel like it's split opinion and it's split generations as well 
So for number two, I actually put this song. It goes, um, uh, Give me all in my lamp, keep me burning. Give me all in my lamp, I pray. And then the, this is the chorus. Sing Hosanna, sing yes, Hosanna, sing Hosanna to the king. I think our words were different. Yeah, I thought it was sing lasagna. Sing lasagna, <laughs> yeah. there you go. But you do so get that. that was I mean, number two? Well, that was number two. It was, yeah. Um, and, OK, the next one, I feel like this is definitely going to be controversial oh, because no. for me, I feel, I feel like for my generation growing up in the 90s and going to primary school then, this was our Sweet Caroline of the school assembly, oh, basically. go on. So it goes, um, Shine, Jesus, shine, fill this land with the Father's glory. Do we know that one? I think we're a bit it old. It's very oh, modern. Yeah. <laughs> it's very modern for us. Yeah. I, f I feel like whenever that one got wheeled out in assembly, the whole the whole room oh. just kind of went nuts. It's really were... era specific, isn't it? It is. It literally yeah. depends how yeah, old you yeah. are. Yeah. So a lot of these. So basically, in the top ten, some of them appeal to people that went to school in the seventies and eighties, and some of them more for the nineties. Um, and I put together a. Um, basically, I was putting out all these videos on TikTok, um, and then I decided to put together a like a show, essentially. And so I get everyone into a room and we all kind of reminisce on school days and, and it's, you know, a very kind of joyous celebration of singing in schools and how lucky we were to actually sing in schools. I mean, it, it yeah. goes... It's, it's, it's wider, this, as well, because, mm -hmm. I mean, Jason Manford yes. uh, has done yeah, this, hasn't yeah. he? Out on tour with, you know, yeah. disco lights and yeah, arenas. Yeah. So, yeah, I think part of his comedy set, he kind of said, yeah. oh, imagine if you were going past a club and then... All of a sudden, you hear heard these songs, and then he kind of made them into rave anthems, which is amazing. Yeah. So. No, he does. He's taken it on tour with all the tunes, and yeah. everyone sings along. Yeah. So, so what are children singing in school now? Well, yeah, you do get a mix, and you get a lot of newer kind of songs that are written specifically for assembly. Um, but then you get a lot of pop songs, and basically, if a pop song that like, has a theme, um, then that always that always suits. But the the problem is that a lot of pop songs <laughs> aren't necessarily massively suitable for. Singing in school, perhaps not. No. Um, so I have because I, I do singing. Do lessons. you ever change the words a bit? Uh, yeah, I yeah. do. <laughs> yeah. So um, we've got Bruno Mars, Count on Me. That's quite a good one. It's, it helps them learning how to count. You know, one, two, three. Mm. So yeah. Great stuff. It's been lovely to meet you. Thank you so Thanks much so for coming much. in, James. And um, I'm not surprised it's taken off because it you just start going with it. Don't you go with it? Yeah. yeah Thank yeah. you very much indeed. Good You're luck. Welcome. Thanks so much.